guys welcome back to my channel so i have a really small dollar tree haul i was just gonna wait till my next one but it's fine i don't really have a ton of videos going up anyways so it's just gonna be a really small one but i wanted to show you so i went to my store last night i needed to get away from my kids for a minute so after dinner i told my husband i was like i'm leaving for like 10 minutes like i just i need to get away um that's what happens when I don't work for a really long time. They've cut back everybody's hours, it's too slow. I don't work until Friday and Saturday. So that's when I get a break for my kids. So this whole week has just been really hard. Um, you know, she doesn't wanna share her toys with her brother or she does something and it's just, it's so like, I can't, I need a break. So I went into my store, walked around, wasn't expecting to find a whole lot. Um, I want to get started on some Valentine's DIYs because um, I have a lot of the stuff just sitting on my patio in my patio on my dining room table and I like don't like the clutter so I was like I need to just start going through what is for DIYs and what's for decor and then just the stuff for decor obviously I'm not decorating for Valentine's Day yet I'm gonna wait till February probably the whole month of February I'll have my area back here and my kitchen so that gives me plenty of time to do DIYs. If you remember before Christmas, I hauled a bunch of these little dice. I never did my Christmas DIY with them. I think I was just overwhelmed with all the Christmas DIYs that I was doing. So I just didn't do that one. I want to do that one this year because I'm not planning on doing a bunch this year um, since I did a lot last year. So like my countdown sign, my snowman sign. So I'll have an extra little DIY to do. And then I had all those wreaths. So obviously now I'm not going to have wreaths to do because I already did them. So I had to go pick up more because I only have three and I need four for what I'm going to do. So I had to pick up another pack. I didn't care what color because I'm going to paint them so it doesn't matter. And then I also picked up one of these ribbed floor mats. Now this is the really, really cheap flimsy one that's really thin. But it's perfect for what I'm going to be doing. Um, I'm gonna DIY this probably both sides and then I'm gonna put it in front of that door over there because if I put this in my kitchen it's just gonna slide around because of the hardwood floors that we have so that's what I went for was that and then I also want to do a DIY with these so I picked up two one for Valentine's Day and I think one will be for st. Patty's Day um, if not then I'll have an extra one I mean they are cute just as they are, but I'm planning on doing a DIY with those. And then I only picked up one Valentine's Day thing. My store, so I was gonna wait to do this haul until uh, Friday when I do my regular big one, but <clears throat> I don't have a lot of videos going up this week, so I wanted to do it. I'm still waiting on my Ipsy. Um, and then I already did Grove, so I'm kind of like just sitting here with nothing. So I was like, oh, I'll just do a little mini Dollar Tree haul. It's fine. Um, my store still hasn't come out with a lot of Valentine's Day stuff that I'm looking for that I need for my DIYs. And that's kind of why I haven't been making my DIYs because I can't. So I'm trying to convince my husband on Thursday to go to a different Dollar Tree. It is a little further away than what he would like. But when we drove past it the other night... I saw that it's huge now so it used to be just like one store and I think the two places next to it moved or went out of business and Dollar Tree rented out those places they tore down the walls and now it's a huge Dollar Tree so I want to go to that one and see if they have what I need I also can check the Dollar Tree by Walmart on Thursday when I go um, he kind of wants me to do that. So I'll go and see if they have it. If they don't have it, then I want to go to that other one because I want to do my DIYs and I can't because I'm missing some stuff that I've seen people haul from Dollar Tree. My, to my Dollar Tree hasn't gotten them yet. So I only picked up one Valentine's Day thing. It was this, um, it's scented mini sticker books. You get six. So there's three on that side and three on that side. So I just picked up those to have. And then I saw on Instagram someone was posting <clears throat> some new stuff in Dollar Tree and I was like, I really like that one. It goes with Easter, but like spring. So I picked up this list pad. Um, it doesn't say anything, but I think it's just so cute because I can leave it up for Easter because I do have like the carrot garland that I made last year I love. And I can leave this up during spring. They had the farmer's market one, 
They had the black one with the farm animals and it said farm to table. They had all of them, but this was the one I wanted. You get 60 sheets in there. I was gonna wait till Thursday, but like I said, I don't know if I'm going to mine or if we're gonna go to a different one. And it has just the one magnetic strip on there. So I'll use that for Easter time. I think I have an Easter one, but I would rather use this one because I really like it. The rest of this is St. Patty's Day stuff. I was so dumbfounded when I walked in and I saw that they were already putting this stuff out, but they didn't have the rest of the Valentine's Day stuff out that I've been looking for. So I don't know if our store is going to get them. If it's in the back and they're waiting, I, I don't know. But it's like, I don't want to wait till the last minute. I want to get these DIYs done. And if I can't do them because I can't find those things, then I need to find something else to do. But I wanted to get this stuff because I know it's going to go fast because last year I didn't get them. I love hanging the boxes over there. So I picked up two and I'm making one like I usually do. I usually buy two and I make one myself. So this one I need to spray and kind of touch up a little bit. They were all really bad. So this was the best one I could find. And it says look of the Irish and white. And if you can see right here, it's like chipped off. So I'll just touch that up with some black paint or uh, green, sorry. Um, but I loved that one. And then I also got this one that says Irish wishes, Irish wish, wishes and shamrock kisses. So I just thought those two were so cute and I can put them over there. My store, I have the white one that says follow your heart, I think from last year or the year before. And they have the one with the flowers on it. I don't want that one. I want the one with the key on it. And it says, I have the key to your heart. My store still never got those ones. So I'm on the hunt for that because I'm making a box for Valentine's Day, but I want two because I like to hang up three right there. If not, I'll just have to deal with the two. I also picked up a pair of socks. Um, I don't think I have my St. Patrick's Day socks from last year because they were the long ones and I don't like those. These ones are really, really fluffy and they say love, but the O is a shamrock instead of the O. So I thought these were so cute. I'll wear these with my St. Patty's Day leggings. I got one of these little decor pieces and it's, it really bugs me that it's a three leaf clover because it's supposed to be a four leaf clover. But I know they do a lot of three leaf stuff. That just doesn't make any sense to me because a good luck clover is supposed to have four leaves. So, but I picked this up to decorate my tray with because I don't really have anything. And last year, I don't think I decorated my tray for St. Patty's Day. I think it was just my window. I don't think I did anything else. <clears throat> so I picked up this. I just thought it was super cute. And then I had to pick up the little hat. I thought it was so cute also. So these are going to go on my tray so I can decorate my three-tier tray for St. Patty's Day. And then they had scarves. I saw this on Instagram and I was like, oh my god, I want the green and black buffalo check. So you get two and they're bandanas so i didn't really care for this one but i was like maybe i'll find something to do with it so i got this because of this one and then it comes with this one and it says irish blessings happy saint patty's day lucky luck of the irish eat drink and be irish so i got that one and then i got this one and it's also a two pack so you get this one with the three leaf and four leaf clovers and then you get the buffalo check so i need the buffalo check one for a diy a DIY so I picked up these they had my store anyways had hats that you can wear they had the necklaces the light up ones they had the table scatter flowers they had little arrangements decorated in this but it was covered in glitter and then they had a few signs one of them was from last year and then they had a new one and they had a new one that was a chalkboard and it's a three leaf clover and it's chalkboard so you can write on it um, I didn't want to go super crazy because I need to pull that stuff out and see what I have so I don't buy duplicates. I know I have window clings because I got them from Michael's last year, but I use window clings for DIYs. So I wanted to pick up these because I don't think the ones that I have say anything. I don't think it says Happy St. Patty's Day or Luck of the Irish or anything like that, but I could be wrong. So I picked up this one because I absolutely love the Happy St. Patrick's Day. That would be perfect for a DIY. I love the hat, the pot of gold, and this one says Luck of the Irish. I really, really like this one. So I grabbed that one. 
And then they had one more, but I left it there because I don't know if I want it. It just had three and four leaf clovers all over it. It didn't have anything else. And then I picked up this one that says Lucky. And it has coins and three leaf clovers on it. So, picked up those two. And that is it. Like I said, this is a really small haul, but I wanted to show you that my store is already putting out St. Patty's Day stuff. They only have one little section of Easter. And it's a lot of the same stuff of, as last year. Um, there is a few new Easter things, but I just wanted to get this stuff now. Uh, mainly those signs because last year they came out with those little wood signs that I put there and I missed out on them. They were all gone, so I didn't get any last year. So anyways, I just wanted to let you guys know and show you the cute stuff that's already out. Um, this was like 16 bucks. It wasn't even that much. So it was a small haul. And I'm sorry, I'm not going to be filming my DIYs. I will be posting them on Instagram. If you don't have an Instagram, I'm sorry. Um, if when it gets closer to Valentine's Day and my house is completely decorated, if enough people want to see it, I'll do a small little tour. Because I only decorate my kitchen and then my front and back door, I hang stuff. That's it. Like my kitchen, my island right here, and that's it. I don't do my living room, my bedrooms, my bathrooms. I would like to do my living room, but my fish tank is on the way, so I can't. So... If you don't have an Instagram and you can't see my Valentine's DIYs, I will do a small little house tour. That way you guys don't miss out on those DIYs and I can just tell you real quick how I did it and what I did. So anyways, that is it for this video guys. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, give it a big thumbs up. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. I'd love for you to be part of my YouTube family if you're not already. And until then, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.